coming back to Brighton, even though it's been 20 years, it's just such a familiar place. You know, I walk back in and back into the club rooms for presentations or out onto the field for a game and it's, it's home and it, and it will always be home. And it's, it's crazy that 20 years separates that, yet I feel like it was just yesterday. And, and that's the, the really neat thing about the Brighton Lacrosse Club. It's, it's always family. I haven't been back to Australia in a long time around this time of year in August. So having a chance to get back and there being a game on and just so happened to coincide with Hannah Nilsson being back as well. So, um, you know, they asked if we'd be willing to get on the field and have a play. And, um, you know, for me, the, the chance to get out there and play with, you know, my niece, with some of our friends, with, you know, just back in a bomber uniform, I couldn't pass it up. I think that's the beauty of Australian lacrosse is it's such a family sport. You know, the opportunity I've got to play with my sister throughout the years, um, the chance to get out on a field and actually get to play with my niece in the league game is just incredible and it's something that I'll treasure in terms of a memory for the rest of my lacrosse career and life. You know, the Brighton team is very strong, so it was fun to get out there and just real strong mix of youth as well as, as other players, you know, getting the chance to play with Mel, uh, having played on an Australian team together with Hannah having played an Australian team together but then um, playing with a bunch of the juniors who are trying out for the under 19 Australian team so it's just generations all across and it's just super cool to be able to do that. I feel very strongly that Brighton has produced some of the best players in the world at the women's level and, and um, I think our future bodes very well we've got a lot of young juniors that have that same kind of twinkle in their eye. Um, you can tell how much they want it and how much they want to improve and have a stick in their hand and how much fun they have playing together. And I think that bond that they're going to share is something that's going to be really special for them as they continue to go through their lacrosse careers and hopefully representing you know, the state and then Australia. And I think for all of us, Brighton gave us that jump start and I see that with them, that they're going to you know, be springboarded into their future careers, which is cool.